The big three could be in big trouble. The Bush administration is now considering a managed bankruptcy. The car companies have been begging for a government bailout, but Congress wouldn't give the green light, and the president is still exploring his options. Credit card companies soon won't have the option of raising interest rates. In the biggest crackdown in decades, regulators are adopting new rules. They want to stop card companies from surprising cardholders with hikes on current balances. The rules go into effect in 2010. FedEx delivered an unwelcome surprise to its employees. It's cutting pay and freezing contributions to retirement funds. While earnings went up 3 percent, demand for shipping is down, and FedEx is bracing for a tough road ahead. President-elect Obama is looking for ways to jumpstart the economy. Aides are working on a giant stimulus package to create new jobs and provide tax relief. But the price tag is high, $850 billion over two years. And 554,000 Americans filed for unemployment claims last week. While that number is high, it's lower than expected. That's your Money Watch. For all your business news, log on to CBSNews.com. At the New York Stock Exchange, I'm Allison Harmelin.